What no! The fuck? Why did this just go out? You need to get out. What you need to get fuck? out. You need to get out. No. You need whoa, whoa, whoa. to. What the fuck? Holy oh! Shit. Oh! What do you do? What do you do, YouTube man? It is your boy Porsche, man. I haven't said that intro in a minute, bro. I haven't said it in a minute, bro. I know y'all checked out the thumbnail, bro. Nah, that's not no no filter, no nothing like that, bro. That's not no no Photoshop or nothing like that, bro. We're gonna be watching some horror. Better yet, we're gonna be reacting to some horror videos. In the dark. <laughs> this is stupid. This is low-key stupid, bro. This is low-key stupid. So guys, if you enjoyed this, man, if you well, if you enjoyed this, I, I gotta stop looking at that one. But if you enjoy this, man. Please be sure to let me know down in the comments. Go crazy. Um, let me know what you want to see next. And let's get into it, bro. You know what I'm saying? This is stupid. This is stupid. Oh, yeah. One more thing. The camera might go out. I'm going to turn it back on. Don't trip, bro. We're gonna, I'm going to fix it. Trust me. I'm going to fix it. Corey, camera, do the same thing. Relax, bro. Relax. You used to it by now. All right. Got a bit of an unusual call today, but... A job is still a job, I guess. I got a call from a kid's restaurant manager saying that they've been experiencing some weird paranormal activity. Let's see. The place is called Ready Fazbear's Pizza. Yeah, we uh, what? Normally, I'd get called in the place. The video's called Paranormal Investigation. Five Nights at Freddy, VA. Places that are abandoned this or is at least old buildings that are at least a century old. But, uh... The strip mall itself looks pretty new, and the manager told me that this particular location was opened roughly five years ago. Was, he mentioned just... that these activities are interrupting businesses, and that they might have to close this location and reopen it elsewhere if I can't this figure out what's crazy. going on. So let me go ahead and read off a few things they told me. So, let's see here. Alright. Uh, they've reported that mysterious and disembodied voices can be heard all throughout the restaurant. Company property, particularly the animatronics themselves, will often move around the restaurant during the night, even when the power to the building is shut off completely. Sometimes said property um, will mysteriously disappear and then reappear a day or so later. And then this is, see, this is why I don't watch stuff in the dark, man. I'm hearing things already, dude. Or I'm seeing things out of my peripherals. I'm seeing things. Was something? Did something just move in my glass? Let me get this over with, bro. One of the incidents they were telling me about where basically a bunch of kids came running out of the bathroom crying because they saw, quote, someone else staring at them in the mirror and that they were speaking in a language they didn't understand. A few employees will often feel a tense presence when working on or next to the animatronics, particularly at night. Night shift workers have reported seeing children, usually one at a time, walk around the restaurant after hours when the doors are what? locked. What? When they go to assess the situation and figure out how the child accidentally got locked in, they are nowhere to be found, and some have even disappeared in full view of a few employees. When checking the security camera footage, these children seem to rage in age and sex, but will consistently look between the ages of 6 and 11. And that's all she wrote. So, based off that information alone, my guess is that this is some sort of poltergeist. Uh, it does sound like there may be more than one in the building, but of course I won't know that for sure until I can hopefully make contact with one of them. You the trying to make- no one's been possessed or has died yet, then it seems these entities may not be violent or demons or anything like that. These very well may just be the spirits of actual children who are maybe just lost and obviously confused about what's going on. Yo. But again, we'll know for sure until we're in there. All right, I believe that's everything I need. Yep, that's everything. All right. <clears throat> okay, I was told the door should be unlocked and nobody should be inside the building. So, let's see what's up with this place. This dude is brave. There's no shot. Nah, me and my bros probably go up in there. We'll probably do that, bro. 100%. Is this made like those, um... Like the, uh, back room videos, bro? Because I know this dude okay, didn't have no so shadow, the bro. Oh, ah, uh, it went out. That seems to be the case. 
Okay, so I told them to make sure that the building's power was cut completely. We're coming just back. to make sure, like, if a light turns on or the temperature changes or anything like that, mm -hmm. then we could rule out the possibility of it being the power. Also, we need to make sure that it's not messing with the EMF reader. But of course, this unfortunately means that I have to work in the dark. Bro, he sounds so happy about this, right, man. Let's get the EMF reader out and let's see. Well, shit, okay. Where's Freddy? So I was told that all of their animatronic characters should be on stage and shut down. And, um, there seems to be one missing. That's not a red flag! I was told there's a bear, a bunny, a chicken, and a fox. And, uh, it doesn't seem like the bear one's on stage. Probably shouldn't jump the gun just yet, though. Maybe one of the employees forgot to take him out of storage or something. Regardless, let's uh forget go ahead and get set up here. Boy, forget jumping the gun, boy. You better shoot that thing, man. Is he serious right now? Alright, let's see what the EMF reader picks up. Starting to get some chills right now, so there must be something close. Yo, I feel yeah, like something here with me. There, but nothing pretty substantial yet. Oh, here we go. Here we go. We something right here. What is a level five? Yeah, it seems to be in this area. Let's go ahead and set up the spirit box then. I'm not. Alright, if there's anyone in the room with me right now, please make your presence known. I need you no harm. I just need to know if anyone can hear me right now. You can either manipulate something in this room or attempt to speak to this device that I've set up for you. I can't do this, bro. My name is Sean. Can you say my name back to me? Sean. Whoa, shit. Here we go. Okay. Just so I can make sure that wasn't a coincidence, can you say my name again? Alright, thank you. So now that I know that I'm speaking to someone, can you tell me your name? Susie? Susie? Did I hear you say Susie? This is stupid. Okay, hi Susie. Is there anyone else in the room with me right now, or is it just me and you? They're here. They're what? Here. Who's okay. they, Susie? What are their names? Do you know their names, Susie? Alright, well if you don't know, that's fine. Just wanted to see if you did know. How old are you, Susie? Do you Yo! remember your age? I'm hearing stuff, man. Is that in the video? Okay. So you must be one of the children that I've heard about. All right, Susie. I guess more to the point. How did you die? Do you remember how you died? I'm not here to hurt you in any way, Susie. I just want to understand what happened to you and why you're here. If you're uncomfortable telling me... Murder? murder? <gasps> Who murdered you? Do you remember this person's name? Bunny. Bunny? Bunny? You were murdered by a bunny? Bunny! Maybe she meant Donnie, like a Donald? Yes. Wait, was that a yes? <laughs> Alright then. Bonnie uh, is on stage looking at you right now, dude. Nice. A 
night. Susie, was this a person dressed like a bunny? Yes. Holy shit. Hold up, I have to make sure the camera got that. Okay, holy I'm shit. So there might have been a murder or something that happened here. Restaurant owners said that they had operated here for five years straight and the paranormal activity didn't start happening until after this July. So this may have been something that happened pretty recently. But I have no idea what that actually means though. Maybe an employee decided he or she had enough, maybe some crack job snuck in here with a bunny suit on, or maybe the spirit's just lying to me. I have no idea. I'll have to show this to the restaurant owners to see if maybe they caught something like that on the security cameras. But let me just say that these responses are certainly not unusual in a place like this. Also, what's surprising to me is how direct they are. They're fairly coherent and understandable, and I'm getting them within a pretty short amount of time, which is usually a clear sign that I'm actually speaking to someone. But anyways, let's see if we can make contact again. That's crazy! What if we get a different one? What if we get a different child this time? Alright, are you still there, Susie? Dude, talk to somebody else! Susie, can you still hear me? I'm scared. Uh, just lost the signal. Bro, you don't have a if flashlight? There are any spirits still in the room with me, please make your presence known. But I think I just heard a chair move. Look, right there. That's at least where the sound came from. It's right next to my flashlight, too. Did Please get the flashlight. The chair out? Please get the flashlight. Are you sitting down right here? Off. Do you want the flashlight off? No. Please don't. Okay, those are brand new batteries. There's no way my flashlight just died. I don't want to watch this no more. Yeah, look at that. It still works. Now that the flashlight's off, will you talk to me now? Yeah. Off again? What else do you want me to turn off? Um, s Noise. Noise? You want me to turn the spirit box off? If I turn off the noise, will you talk to me? Alright, let's go ahead and turn the spirit box off for now. Alright, I turned the noise off. Whoever you are, I'm not trying to hurt you. I just want to have a conversation with you. Can you tell me where you are right now? The fuck is that noise? What the fuck what? is that? What? Hello? What was that? Hold up, hold up, hold up. The fuck is that noise? What the fuck is that? Bro, was that Foxy? Hello? I don't know if the camera could see that. Oh, I saw it. I sure just saw a head stick out and move over there. Yo, I thought something ran across there, bro. That looked like be no one here but me. That 100% looked like Foxy running. So I'm gonna have to rewatch the footage to get a better look at whatever that Let's do it now. was. But Let's it do it like now. Let's do it 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 now. let us do it now 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 let this needs to be over right now. Look at that. Now it's locked. Is this needs to be locked? over. Yeah, this needs to be over locked. right now, bro. I don't want to do this no more. I don't want to well, do this no more in the dark. I was going to do some stuff in the bathroom to see if I could get the spirit the kids saw to reveal itself, but uh, it seems like the spirit isn't a fan of that. So maybe I could come back tomorrow or something and see if the owners can unlock the door again and maybe take off its hinges so there won't be a door for the spirit to lock, you know? Anyways, I seriously need to check the footage because I need to make sure the camera even got what I just saw a moment ago. 
All right, so it looks exactly what I saw, which was pretty much a shadow apparition of someone. It also looked like it could be a small kid, maybe which would make sense if it's one of the children that the night guards were talking about. Oh my gosh, bro. Believe, you know, a lot more than I did originally, that maybe oh my the gosh. spirits presiding here. The voice they kept saying, off, off, sounded completely different than the first spirit I talked to, so I don't know. This is stupid. Let's, uh, go ahead and this turn is stupid. the spirit box back on. See if we can get anyone else here I'm to nervous. talk to me and also see if any other activity will happen. I'm nervous. If not, then I'm probably going to call it quits for tonight. <laughs> oh! Holy shit. Hello? Who is it? That's got to be one of the children. The spirit box Look not even that. on though, bro. Now she's gone. Hold up. Let me grab the case. So oh, we dealing with some demons, dude. Cannot. Oh my gosh, bro! You turning that camera too fast for me, man. Oh, huh. Well, I guess that explains where you were the entire time. I'm uh. I'm having a bit of a hard time believing you were left like that, though. That's what I'm saying, bro. I decided to do a session with one of these things, so I guess now's a better time than any to see if these spirits are in fact controlling the animatronics themselves. Going in with the big guns now. Gonna set up an ovulus for this session. So hopefully I can get some clearly spoken words. Oh my gosh, it's gonna right. sound like that? Is there anyone in the room with me right now? Anyone who'd like to communicate with me. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm about to turn my camera off and back on because I don't want to miss what's about to happen, bro. Because I know something stupid is about to happen, bro. I'll be right back. All right, we back. I don't want to miss nothing. I, of course, mean you no harm. I just want to know if someone else is in here with me. Oh, my God. I saw somebody was breathing behind him. Did, uh... Did someone here move the... I am. You are? Okay, good. What's your name? Gabriel. Gabriel. All it's right. somebody else. Hi, Gabriel. Can you tell me roughly where you are in the room? Don't say in Freddy's stomach. There. Oh! Bear. So you're saying you're in front of the bear? Inside. Inside. Oh my gosh! Are you the one who moved the bear in here? Gabriel, why are you possessing the animatronics here? I'm not going to assume you're going trapped. To... Trapped. You're you're trapped inside that thing? How did you get trapped? Gabriel, I know this may be uncomfortable for you, but I can't help you unless you answer my questions. How did you get trapped in that thing? Don't piss him off, man, please. Okay, well, if you're still troubled by what happened to you, then I guess we can skip those questions. If it means you'll keep... Bro, how long we got left? I'm ready okay. to get off. Do you remember how you died, Gabriel? Don't say Freddy, please. Murder. Oh, murder. my. That's the murder. second child that said murder, exactly man. What Susie said. Exactly. Do you remember who murdered you, Gabriel? Please don't say it. Don't say bear. Him? him? What? What do you mean, him, Gabriel? Do you remember his name? Gabriel, whether you're trying to or not, Don't. you're causing a lot of problems for the people who own this place. Now, if you help me out... He must die. Die. Ah! Die. 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 Will die. I assume you're talking about your killer. I don't know if I'm going to kill him, per se, but I'm willing to find him and make him pay for what he did to you and Susie. Now, just tell me what you remember of him. Did you catch a glimpse of him, maybe? I can't. Do you remember what he looked like? Bro, you, what you, he was wearing? You pissing him off, bro. Purple. Purple. Bunny? Okay, purple. Well, at least that's something. I was told by the restaurant owner that the employees here wear purple outfits. <gasps> Did this person look like he worked here, maybe? Yes. Yes. Interesting. 
Did you ever see his face? Can you describe it to me? No, too dark. No, too dark. Okay, oh. so it must have been too dark to make out the facial features, I guess. All right, so one last thing I want to ask before I go. No, oh, bro, you I actually- I was talking to another spirit here named Susie, and she mentioned something about someone in a bunny suit. Does that sound familiar to you? Bunny! Gabriel, are you still there? Oh my Get god. Out. See? Get out. Why? Why do you want me to leave, Gabriel? Get out. Get out. <gasps> Have I said something to upset you? Get ah! out. What no! the fuck? Why did this just go out? You need to get out. What you need to get fuck? out. You need to get out. No. You need whoa, whoa, whoa. to. What the fuck? Holy oh! shit. Oh! 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 Open the door! Don't do this to me! There you go! He's behind you! Oh my gosh, who was that, bro? What, bro? Watching these things in the dark hit different. I was hearing some crazy things and seeing some crazy things while I was watching it, bro. Guys, if you enjoyed it, bro. Let me know down in the comments, man, what I should react to next. And did and, uh, and um did y'all enjoy this, bro? And if you want to see more, I am out this thing. Poor game. Get me, get me out. Get me out right now.